Both teams have sent their special teams out of the field, and we're ready for the opening kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Blazers, in talking with them this week, Kirk, it's just interesting their perspective on this kid, how good he is, and how much they can lean on him. Yeah, you and I had a chance to visit with not only the coaches, but the player himself. And I got a real good vibe walking out of those meetings and, and thinking that he's going to have a huge game. The coaches seem confident in being able to give him the football in different areas on the field. This kid has a look in his eye that I haven't seen in a long time, where he just wants to have a chance to have an impact on the game and on the outcome. And I, I'd be shocked if they can slow him down. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 26-yard line. Out of bounds, right around the 28-yard line. A couple of yards there. Well, it's a good job here to just secure the football, but he just doesn't have enough speed to turn that into something big. They come out in an empty backfield. They'll bring him down at about the 49. Great effort here by the wideout to secure the ball and pick up some extra yardage. First down. From the 49-yard line, it's first down. Mike Sick, 33, 33. Tackle at the 48. He knew it was a run all the way and got a good jump. Once he got there, he wasn't about to let him slip away either. And they push him out around the 49-yard line. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 39. That brings up third and 10. It's arguably the loudest crowd in the nation, and they are turning it up a notch. But I love the toughness here by this quarterback, sitting in until the last second, trying to make a play downfield, only to have this defense get to him. He's got to do a better job maybe feeling things out a little bit, but at least he has the awareness and a toughness to sit in that pocket. Booming kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. And he throws it away. From their own 20-yard line, it's second down. He gets rid of this one. Check pass. Check pass. 51, Mike. Mike they come 51. out in a five wide set. Go, go four. Go. Completes it, but he can't shake the defense. Nothing the offense dialed up was enough to get by these guys. They're on right now. And this one is a beauty. <laughs> Alabama's loving this crowd support, and they get it week in and week out. Well, that's one thing they can count on every single time they play in this stadium is creating an environment that's going to allow them to play with an edge on defense. Great start to this game. Now let's see if they can just continue that. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. Brought down at about the 39-yard line. From their own 39-yard line, second down. And 
and this crowd is going absolutely crazy. And he hits him hard at the 49. I think he just barely got it. That's a great job by both the quarterback and receiver to keep this drive alive. From their own 49-yard line, first down. Play action. Now he's going to run and watch out, and he's taken down around the 43-yard line. Well, they didn't get the first down, but it was still a pretty good run by the quarterback. He made a good decision to take off there. Short yardage situation here. Second down and one. Three down, three down. Hey, check mark 33. Check mark 33. Ready! Oh, Light 50! If you kill Light 50! Motion, motion, I got one! He fights forward to about 40. That's a gain of three on the play. First down. Here we go, D! Here I come! Here I come! Mike check, 33! 33! And he's tackled right around the 38-yard line. From the 38 yard line, second down. It's our time. It's a fumble. Picks up the loose ball. Tackle made at the 28 yard line. And this is the eighth play of the drive. They come out in a goal line set. He's taken down at the 12. From the 12-yard line, first down. He tackles him for a loss. It's a big time read by this safety. You know, a lot of times as a safety, you're sitting back there making sure there isn't a play action pass or play potentially that can go behind you. I think this safety has that sixth sense. His instincts on that play were special. He read the run, got into the backfield, and made the play. On the ground, up the middle. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. It's the 11th play of the drive. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. A defensive end with this kind of speed is an offensive worst nightmare. He's got the ability to collapse the pocket on any given pass play. And as a play caller, you constantly have to be aware of it. Whether you're going to roll away from him, or you're going to chip with a tight end or a running back, you're constantly concerned and aware of a big, strong defensive end. We played one. Now this one's scoreless. Set to resume action here in the second quarter, and we've got a tight ball game. UAB is looking to go up by three. Kicks up, and they tack on three points. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And they can forget about returning this one. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. He's gobbled up in the backfield. The defense was all over that draw play. They got very good containment on the halfback. He had nowhere to go with the football. From their own 22-yard line, it's second down. Mike, Mike 51, Mike 51. Red two, And he makes it out to about the 24-yard line. That makes it third and 11. Three down. Hey, 
Mike 51, Mike 51. Black five, go! He lets it go, and it's picked off. That's a great tackle at the 45-yard line. He seems a little hesitant on that throw, and that left the defender time to break on the ball and pick it off. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 45-yard line. UAB is up a field goal. He has some room. And they make the stop at about the 37-yard line. That makes it second and two. after a decent run up the gut. Gain of seven yards. We've got a first and, ten. first and ten. Ball on the 30-yard line. <laughs> Zips it to the tight end. He's tackled at the 18. Look at the cool back there. Even with the outside linebacker blitzing, he made an accurate throw on the new set of downs. Scrambling around. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. And down he goes, right around the six-yard line. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. Sometimes a young quarterback will make a silly mistake or a receiver will come down with a case of stone hands, but not with this group. He makes the PAT. So a five-play, 46-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass, just an overall well-executed. This defense has played well enough to be able to win this game, but at some point, you'd love to see their own offense feed off of some of the confidence that their defense is playing with, because up to this point, the defense is keeping them in the game. The hey, offense isn't quite 14. doing enough to be able to build on that lead. Gains his way to the 40-yard line. There's nothing more effect that a team can do offensively than to pound the ball right at the and to wear them down. From their own 40-yard line, it's first down. They get with a run, and he runs down the backfield. That's a loss of two yards. That'll bring up second and 12. Going deep, lays it out there. Can't pull it in. Number two was the intended receiver on the play. Third down now, and they need to get it out to the 50. Three down, three down. Mike, Mike 51, Mike 51. And two, go. Three, three, three. And he tackles him hard. It's a 32-yard line. That's a six-yard loss. Well, that play was sort of out of sync from the start, but you have to also recognize that the defense made a great play. They read it from the get-go. Oh, excellent punt. He makes it out to maybe the 29-yard line. The Blazers are sitting pretty now after getting out of that slow start at the beginning. Yeah, things were a little sluggish early, but my gosh, these last few series, they just seem to be, at this point, just kind of setting a tone and kind of having their way against this defense. So it's time to see this offense go to work again. This defense couldn't stop them from moving the ball and inevitably finding the end zone. 
nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. Well, they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice game. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Makes it out to maybe the 40-yard line. Game of two on the play. First down. Here we go! Check, check! 98 Weasel! The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 40. And a quick throw. They'll bring him down around the 47-yard line. Everything about that play was crisp. The route, the throw, the catch, that's fun to see. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five right. wide receivers in the formation. Got a man, watch out here, tackle at the 40. It's a smart job here by the coaches, making a play call here that really played to their offensive strengths. That's knowing your personnel. From the 40-yard line, first down. Fires that quickly, incomplete. The receiver needed to get a step or two further into his route to have any chance of snagging that pass. Here we go! Once and all, go deep. Picked off. Well, that's exactly what they needed, Brad. Somehow to get back to their own. First and ten. Ball on the nine yard line. Quick out to his receiver. I think it was a great play call. It was very well executed. Any coach would be happy with that kind of outcome on a first or second down play. So it's second down and about two yards to go. Five wide. Green nine, green nine. Hey, go, seven. Three yard line. That one goes for good yardage and a first down. Yeah, that's just a nice gain on second down. From their own 33 yard line. First down. He airs it out. And he hauls it in. Spectacular play, and now it's first and goal. We've still got a half of football remaining. The Blazers with a 10 point lead. Welcome to the EA Sports Halftime Show. Reese Davis, David Pollock here. And David, this is a game that people have been anticipating watching all week. There's been a lot of energy in the stadium. Great watch for the fans at home so far. Yeah, Reese. And the, and the fans, they get excited. They want a bunch of points, but they all like you can get a ball on the deep ball. Get something you know your guy going. You feel good. You know what? Back on the you can just feel the energy and the intensity of this game. We're going to get more of that in the second half. Alabama's find themselves with an obstacle to clear in the second half. They need something to go in their favor, a spark to kind of generate a little enthusiasm and some energy. 
Brad and Kirk are ready to go. I think Brad's tie and pocket square in exquisite condition, so they're ready for kickoff. Welcome back, everybody. Second half action about to begin. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Blazers continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. And they get the sack. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. So the sack makes this a second and long. Four down, four down. Go. Mike, Mike, 51, Mike, 51. Dog, four. Go. And he's taken down at the 31. Side. It's coming really close, but they converted on that run by an eyelash. First and ten, ball on the 36-yard line. Black five, black five, exit. He's scrambling, runs with it, and he's got room. And he's tackled at about the 43-yard line. Good coverage by the defense. But they have to be aware of this quarterback's tendency to scramble around and pick up some yards. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Four down, four down. Go, Mike 51, Mike 51. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Green out. <laughs> The running back gets two on the carry. I feel the corner position is really one of the hardest to play. So when I see a young player like this make a play like that, phew, it's impressive. Check tight right, tight right, tight right. Follow out there, check the outs out there. Four down, four down. 51 Mike. Red two. Go. And he is drilled, the 47-yard line. This kind of execution from an offense can really affect the defense in their psyche. That's the second time on this drive alone they've been able to convert on a third down. This defense has got to be able to kind of gather themselves and try to find some confidence. And somebody on that defense has got to be able to make a play to slow this offense down. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. From the 47-yard line, second down. Quick throw. Tackle made the 33-yard line. This is the ninth play of this drive. Him hard at the 35. That'll bring up second and 12. From the 35 yard line, it's second down. Red two, green nine. Mercy, mercy. He's taken down at the 28. Here's the 11th play of the drive. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. 51, Mike. Mike, 51. Right Throws falling back and got his man. And they make the stop at the 20-yard line. From the 20-yard line. It's first down. He fights forward to about the 20. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. You're not going to be able to get by a short tackler like this linebacker too often. 
And this is the 13th play of this drive. Four down, four down. Let's go. Mike, Mike, this defense is looking to make it three straight trips to the red zone without a single point. Boy, was he drilled as he let go of that football. Yeah, he's going to feel that one tomorrow. So again, a third down as the offense lines up. And he's level at the 27 yard line. That's a loss of seven yards. That makes it fourth and long. And they can make this a one possession game with this kick right here. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and it's good. Alabama is ready to kick it away. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down to the end zone for a touchback. They're ready to begin another drive. UAB is up seven. Completes it across the middle. He's tackled at the 39. That's a smart play here by the quarterback. He threw it into the window the zone coverage gave him. Nice pass and a nice job by the receiver running the slant. They come out on an empty backfield. And down he goes at about the 47-yard line. I'll tell you something. I'm loving this quarterback's confidence more and more as this game goes on. He's really throwing the ball with some purpose. It's first and ten. Ball on the 47. I can't believe they even let you play. Mike check, 33. Ready! 33. Three, four, <laughs> Tosses across the middle to his tight end, and he's tackled right away. Number 32 with the tackle, the 37-yard line. First down. <laughs> Carries the ball for a nice game. That makes it second and six. Second and six. Ball on the 33. Good job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. Steps up. Fires out to his wideout. That's a great tackle at the 12-yard line. First down. What was that? Let's go, let's go, let's go! Lack of offense or great defense, call it what you will. We head to the fourth quarter. 10-3, UAB. All right, we're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. UAB is up a score. Ready! Black 68! Black 68! Hut, hut! He makes it out to maybe the 10 yard line. This is the eighth play of this drive. Fires incomplete. He was looking for the tight end. And so it's another third down upcoming here. 
really one of the very tough places to play in college football, and it's no different today. Caught with room to work. Knocked out of bounds right around the two-yard line. That's good decision-making there and mechanics by the quarterback. He knew where he wanted to go with the ball, but he looked off the other receivers first. Let's go! Touchdown, Blazers! And he adds the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. We're about set to start things up again. Gets to about the 27 yard line. That's a gain of two on the play. That makes it second and eight. From their own 27 yard line. Second down. Mike 51. Here we go, here we go, here we go. He gets out to about the 28 yard line. this quarterback today the pass protection has got to do a better job but give this defense some credit they've really figured out what they have to do to pressure the quarterback and to cause him some problems It looks like they're going to go after this punt. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. He's taken down at the 43-yard line. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Did you see how the defense just swarmed to the ball carrier? That was fantastic pursuit. From their own 42-yard line, it's second down. Just over two minutes in the game. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. Alabama's going to take their first time out of the half. The crowd at this stadium, always a factor in a football game. Fires out to his receiver, and he's immediately tackled. When they broke the huddle, I'm sure everybody knew the ball was going to go to this receiver, and he still brought it in to give this team a big lift. Alabama will use their final timeout. And he gets a yard on the run. And there's not much he could do to get away from the junior safety on that play. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 45. It's a great run, and he's brought down in the backfield. More plays like this, and the coaching staff is going to need to change up the blocking scheme. You can't allow the defense to play in your backfield. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Easy, easy, easy. Lucky 95. Lucky 
tackles him hard at the 30-yard line. Number 62 brings him down at the 30-yard line. That makes it first and 10. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 30-yard line. Under a minute left. Keep 15. Keep 15. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. Here's the eighth play of the series. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. And he'll just take a knee here to kill the clock. This one's in the books, and our final score, 17-3, Blazers. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.